say something for us. Hey there, Internet. I'm here with Chef Nui at KYU2 KYU2 Sushi in Emeryville, right on 65th and Hollis. And we're going to learn today how to make some sushi. Yes, so today we're going to try to do the Emerylo and Volcano for the customer in the pond. So first thing they have the noli, two noli, mm -hmm. and the rice uh, around one hand like this. So you make like a snowball. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So every single chef, they have a different way to do somebody they put in the front. Mm -hmm. But uh, what I do, I learn from my master. I start from here. Then go down here. Go down here. And in the middle. Mm. So the rice, when you put on the noli, uh, I mean the seaweed, uh, seaweed paper, you have to be like go this way, mm -hmm. not flat together because the this side and this side can go stick together like a groove. Mm. So a little bit of a curve motion yes. kind of. Correct. Okay. And what is this exactly? Uh, this one we call volcano inside mm. uh, shrimp tempura Ooh. and this uh, imitation crab. Mm. Uh, made from fish actually, mm. not not crab. <laughs> and this is a crab salad. So when you load it, you put inside here, and you pull from the middle and then yeah. all the way around. Just put inside the paper, and you load it like this. Okay, this one we call okay no. Top with a spicy tuna. Mmm. Make it spicy. Okay. And next, I have the emery roll. The emery roll is kind of almost the same, but inside, no uh, trim. You put this one inside. The spicy, spicy tuna. tuna? Yes. And a little avocado. Yes. So every single, when you cut it, every single piece of the sushi is supposed to have everything equal. Mm. So in the middle, a little not enough uh, avocado, so I put in the middle. Mm. Okay. Same thing. I pull back here and put inside rolling and spicy crab on the top. Mm. That's different than the imitation crab? Uh, this one just put a spicy thing. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Little plastic wrap. Yeah, easy to cut. Everything not fall down. So when you make a law, you press side first. This side, this side, side, and then you put on the top. The law is not going to be the lowering like a, a circle. Mm -hmm. It's going to be the angle, uh, triangle, the square. Yeah. yeah. Try to be square as much as you can. It's hip to be square. Yes, correct. You ever hear that song? Yes. Uh, Back to the future. Square. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and cut half first. Okay. Always dip it in the water so it gets a better cut. Uh, the clean. The rice not stick to the knife. Mm, with water. Yes. 
when you dip in the water, you have to push it and water go down. Mm. Easier. Now clean for the next time. So I do the shape again. Very nice. And just put in the box. This is to go. To go, yes. This one volcano is the more spicy than this one. Mm. How spicy for most people you think they could handle uh, the spice? I like most, really spice. Most of people I think this one yeah, everybody can handle. Because the sushi we cannot put too much spicy. Because of if you put too much spicy, your tongue gonna taste another fish taste. Mm. Yeah, so everything has to be just your tongue can handle. It is. Even just getting the shape of it. Yeah. Spicy mayo on top. And this one more stuff on top. Uh, the fish ball topico? Yeah. The fish ball topico? This one uh, topico. This is interesting. I've loved sushi for so many years but I'd never liked topico because it always gets in my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only reason. It tastes good. It's you know caviar. But... A lot of people don't like it. Yeah. But uh, for me I like it because you feel like when you buy it like something pop, pop up. In, yeah, yeah, almost mouth. like a boba. Yeah, yeah. My daughter really loves it, but I am uh, I'm mixed, mixed bag on it. And the different colors, it's different Mix types. More. Actually, they just put color. This one, but the green one is wasabi. Mmm. Well, then maybe I'll try that one sometime. They have I'm some like wasabi spicy thing addict. Too. It's beautiful. It's like a work of art. Yeah. And we put some um, the uh, finger bit on the top. The crunchies. Yeah. That's it. And put the wasabi ginger. Excellent. Thank you so much for watching. Definitely check them out in Emeryville. Hit a like, hit that subscribe button, hit the notifications, write some comments. What role do you want to see our chef make next? We hope to make this a series and do lots of different sushi, but it's all up to you viewers. You got to share this, you got to like it, you got to let people know. They can learn to be a sushi chef here. You just got to gotta get the traction going. And come on by and learn in person as well. All right. Thank you so much. See you. Give you a hug. <laughs> mini heart. Mini heart.